Hello there! Today I want to show you our new queens. As you can see, um, there's one on the left, the big one with the big butt. Um, as I said in my last video, uh, we were surprised to find some new queens in uh, our colony. And uh, I think it's due to the fact that they have enough to eat and uh, so they are able to produce new queens. So Maypril, our old queen, so the mother of the colony, is still producing eggs, but they decided to make new queens. There's another one, and here's number three. So they work as um, normal workers, but are bigger. I haven't seen them producing eggs or something like that, but uh, they are part of the colony now and uh, are accepted by all of the other ants. So here you can see how they are working on a cockroach. <laughs> busy, busy. <laughs> He tries to, uh, she, sorry, she tries to, um, to get a bit off. It's not that easy. I'm always trying to clean this part of the arena, but uh, they always put another stuff on there. And here you can see how they live in the nest now. Um, they, they've already eaten most part of the dick figs. Also here, on the second one, and um, yeah, we are already uh, considering a new nest, to buy a new nest, and we'll see about that. So, they really love that new arena, the bigger one, and uh, as you can see, they, they are also there um, with all their food. This is their little water pot and um, they are always waiting each day uh, for the water to come. It's really interesting because um, you see those little parts of sand in there. They are putting them uh, in. They are putting in some parts of the sand so they are able to walk on the water. I've, I've already seen that and I'm trying to uh, catch that on camera next time. So you can also see that. So no ants are drowning anymore. They've learned to do that. So this is the, the other water supply, but uh, they are using it as a little nest, I guess. The bigger water supply. Um, I'm always seeing ants in there. Sorry for the bad camera. Thing, but um, yeah, sometimes the mobile phone isn't catching up with all the moving. So this is the food supply. And you can see a few dead ones, but they are always putting it in one, in, on one side of the nest. Yeah, they are working on the cockroaches now. I just put them in a few, uh, I think, half a, mm, yeah, they, I put them in uh, one hour before, I think, and uh, they've already dismembered the second one. And this is uh, the third one I put in. Yeah, and they also made a new nest down in the sand. So, um, uh, we didn't plan that, but they decided that the sand would be a nice cozy home. So, they are making holes into the sand and uh, starting to live under there. So, making their own nests. Here you can see queens with wings. 
they never use their wings. I, I've uh, watched them for a few days now and uh, they don't use them, but uh, have them for a few days and then they fall off. Or they are chewed off, I think, sometimes. Uh, I, I, I assume they somehow get rid of them. But it's very interesting that we have so many queens now. <laughs> I can find queens every day now. And um, yeah, that's very interesting. But they don't lay eggs. I mean, I think they are, the, they are not fertilized. So um, yeah. So there's one of the queens going up now. Yeah, we will see what they'll make of it. As you can see, I made a little cut. That's another day I, I was filming. And, uh, well, they worked on their nest, obviously. And you can see all the sand in the water pit. That's what they are doing. And it's a good strategy for them, obviously. Yeah, that was another... Uh, part of our ants and i hope you liked it so if you liked it please give me a like and share the video and subscribe of course if you haven't done it yet and i hope i'll see you next time bye